Which technique is best used to separate pure water from salt water? A. Filtration B. Evaporation or C. Distillation All three techniques can be used to separate a liquid in a solid. Filtration only works if the solid is not dissolved in the liquid. The mixture can be run through a porous filter paper which will trap the solid, the residue, and let the liquid pass through the filtrate. Filtration will not work in this case because the salt is dissolved in water. Evaporation involves heating the mixture which makes the liquid turn to a gas which leaves behind the solid. This will not work because you won't be able to recover the water. Distillation involves evaporation followed by condensation of the gas back to a liquid. This is the best technique to use. So the correct answer is C. Here's a typical laboratory setup for filtration. A funnel is mounted on a ring stand. A piece of filter paper is folded to fit into the funnel. The mixture to be separated is poured into the funnel. The paper traps the solid, which is called the residue. The liquid, called the filtrate, passes through the paper and is collected in a beaker. This is essentially the same technique used in a coffee maker. Here's a typical laboratory setup for separating a mixture by evaporation. The mixture is placed in a porcelain evaporating dish. The mixture is then heated. The liquid turns into a gas and the solid is left behind in the evaporating dish. Here's a typical laboratory setup for distillation. A mixture is placed in a flask. As the mixture is heated, the liquid turns into a gas, which rises and is guided into a condenser. The condenser is just a tube that is jacketed within a larger tube. Water flows through the outer tube to keep the inner tube cool. As the gas comes in contact with the cool tube, it condenses back to a liquid. The liquid is collected as it exits the condenser. The distilled liquid is also called the distillate. 